Hey you guys and welcome back to my channel. So the only reason why I'm filming this video is because literally the video I filmed talking about all this stuff somehow got deleted in the mixture of who knows. So I decided to film this video over a mug bang since hey we like to eat and let me get the paper. So like I said I decided to film it over a mug bang. And you know, I wrote it down some key points to talk about what's going on. But first, I kind of want to let you guys know what I'm having. I got spaghetti, some cabbage, and a little bit of garlic bread. And then I got my water as well. I poured in the cup, but that's what I'm having right now. First, let me say my prayers. Heavenly Father, thank you for blessing me with another meal. Thank you for continuing to have my back through all these ups and downs. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. Let me go ahead and pour me some water, y'all. So, how is y'all night going? How is it going, everyone? How are y'all doing? This spaghetti looks so bomb, y'all. Kind of need a thumbnail. Okay, let me just pour it up. Let me go ahead and get a bite. I did um, add a hot sauce to my spaghetti. And there's sausage in here as well. Mmm. The kids are asleep, so I'm able to, you know, come talk to y'all without having any interruptions. Mm. Look, honey, I need to get some food in first. <laughs> so. I have a few things I want to talk to y'all about. I wrote down because I had to go with, you know, my keynotes. So, a lot of y'all have so many questions and a lot of y'all have so many assumptions about me. So I was like, you know what, let me come and talk to y'all and answer y'all's questions and everything I may have. Mm. Mm. This is really good. A lot of y'all think that I let my kids stay up late. You guys, I do not. I don't. Night times. Night times are my me time, my alone time, my time away from my kids. As long as I let them stay up, it's on the weekends, and that's like till, oh, did I put my chin? Till 9 o'clock. They don't stay up all night, y'all. <sighs> Another thing 
I addressed in this video that I didn't get to address. I mean, we'll talk to y'all about is my house. A lot of y'all think my house is just so messy. Oh my god. Y'all act like I live in like I'm a hoarder or something. When my house is really not messy. Um, I did post a video with me cleaning, I mean folding clothes and I swore up and down that I was, my house was messy and it really wasn't y'all. My house was literally just clothes everywhere and I didn't leave the clothes on the floor at night. I picked all the clothes up and put them in baskets for the next day for me to go put them in everybody's room. Now. As for people kept saying like you're hot you have like little specks of dirt on your floor you guys <laughs> them little specks of dirt it be from the twins sometimes I'll vlog whenever they're eating snacks I sweep my house three times a day morning noon and like when they go to bed only because it's unless you know there's something on the floor extra and I gotta sweep it because of the twins I don't let me show you this spaghetti there you go. So, mm, I clean up my house. I Swiffer every night. I mop once a week. Only because the swings are on the floor 24 7. Just because Aiden got a spider bite does not mean I'm messy. Come on now. Let's be honest. How does that make sense? A spider bite messy. Does that even really make sense at all to you? I'm going to talk about another thing. People were saying, why don't you put your kids on a schedule? My kids are hard on schedule. Back to that. They go to bed at a decent time because I want my alone time. <laughs> they are on a schedule. That's why I like in my life they're always saying, Jasmine, where are your kids? Are you really asking me what my kids are? It's 10 o'clock at night. They're in bed. They're in bed by 9 at the latest. Most of, they're in bed, most of the time they're in bed by 8. So, I don't know what to tell y'all. That looks so good. I just want to get another thumbnail. I don't know. It might turn out good, but. Hmm. I don't know why people be thinking, how do you let my kids do whatever they want? Trust me, I'm not that mom. This cabbage. This is leftover cabbage from this past weekend. If you haven't seen that vlog, it's over on my other channel. Hmm. Oh, this is so good. Mm -hmm. I haven't ate all day. This is my first time eating. Mm -hmm. I don't have time to sit down and eat with the kids. If I do, nine times out of twin, the, nine times out of ten, the twins will eat my food and their food. <laughs> Yeah, this is good. Oh, 
that water. That water is hidden. <sighs> Woo! Y'all be so pressed on the fact that my kid's hair is not always done 24 7. I do that hair. Now, I do have arthritis in my hands really bad. Even when I do my own hair, it my hands tense up and I have to stop. Girls' hair, I cannot stop. I got to get it done or I will not go back to it because they have so much hair. And it gets hard to braid consistently all the time. I have three girls. Ava's hair, I just put the more the shea butter in her hair. Um, I put hers in a ponytail, little puff ball. Amaya's, I do braid it up too, but I have a lot of girls. I have three girls with a lot of hair. When I get a chance to do it, I do it. We're not going anywhere. Y'all think because I'm a blogger, I should do their hair, or because my hair is done. Technically, my hair is not done. If I throw a wig on, that doesn't mean my hair is done. I just covered up the mess. <laughs> I'm just going to say that. Mm. That's really what I do. Another thing is that they take Amaya takes her hair bows and her beads out of her hair. Kaylin's hair just gets messed up sometimes because her edges has always been short. Even as a baby, oh that must be some. I'm not eating that sauce. Oh, it's not burnt on that side. And so her hair comes out of her hairstyle easily. It be like that sometimes. Mm. I'm getting so full, cool, y'all. For this being my first meal, I'm getting full. Cool. I ate sunflower seeds, but. I haven't really ate anything. <laughs> Woo. This was a big plate of spaghetti. Mmm. That sausage was good. I did cook corn too, y'all. I'm gonna want to save some for the girls tomorrow. Mm. I'm full. <laughs> Oh my god, you guys, that was so freaking good. I haven't ate anything all day. But I did want to come on here and say thank you guys so much for tuning in to today's video. I'm glad I was able to talk to y'all and get some of the stuff cleared up because there's a lot of stuff. People just have so many damn questions and worried about the wrong thing. <laughs> so, hopefully I cleared that up. There's other stuff I, of course, got to talk about. And I do plan on clearing that up for you guys as well. Let's get this video to two, 3K thumbs up. And comment down below questions y'all want to see as well. I love y'all. Thank y'all so much for watching. Bye, guys.